What up everybody, my name is Zach, welcome back to Case Digital, and in today's video we're answering the question of how to make a string uppercase in Python. So, without further ado, let's hop right in and start coding. What up everybody, so we're making strings uppercase today, and is there a naive approach to do this? Probably. <laughs> and what I say by that is because um, there, I thought about making, trying to go about doing a naive approach to this, where someone would be like, oh, I know what's in the string, like I know how to spell surprise, so I'm just going to go through and make sure every letter in that is capital. But are people really going to do that? No, because Python has actually made this really simple for people to make uppercase strings um, by using the upper method. And essentially, all you have to do is just do, um, you take your string, so surprise, uh, our surprise string, and I just do dot upper. And if I print this out, you'll see that this will make, um, and if I print out the previous as well, surprise string and then print out our wacky string. Um, you'll essentially see that this makes everything uppercase. And well, does it handle the case where strings like our wacky string already have, you know, if I just came in here, had already uppercase letters, what's it gonna do? Is it gonna affect that? And if we go out here and we just print this out and you'll see that all right, it doesn't matter. It just essentially will go through the, your string and anything that's lowercase, it'll make it uppercase. Anything that's already uppercase, it'll keep it uppercase. Um, and even if, if it applied to it, like I could say, I could take my wacky string and say it's capital A. And even if it's already capital A, it's still just going to be capital A. Um, so there it is, folks. That is how you make a string uppercase in Python. Um, I hope this has provided value. If it has, please smash that like button. And if you haven't subscribed, subscribe. Let's keep learning and programming with one another. And until next time, keep on programming.